we, first of all, we, we, we empathize with uh, our customers and the population in general uh, in Rwanda, in the region, continental or world over, uh, that, that this unfortunate uh, epidemic uh, has hit or has affected most of uh, people's well being. Um, so, what we've done, we've looked at uh, most SMEs who are, for instance, in sectors like tourism. We understand that those will be gravely affected. They would be more affected than the others. Uh, but even those who are either suppliers or distributors of SMEs, we understand they're also going to be affected. So what we've done as Equity Bank Rwanda, we've put in place uh, a framework to help guide us on our actions, but with the intention of uh, making it easy, as easy as possible for SMEs, uh, first of all, to make it out of the pandemic so they can get back to business, uh, but secondly, to also relax um, uh, modalities of their commitments, those who had loans. Uh, and for instance, we've looked at uh, every sector and given it a, a, a duration in which we expect things to have uh, uh, picked up or cash flows to have, to have recovered. Now for, for companies, we now have a complete end-to-end -end virtual bank uh, operational. EasyBiz is also a complete uh, cash management application. Uh, we understand that uh, the new normal is not going to be uh, an easy one. We understand that with uh, uh, the effects of, of, of this pandemic, and which is likely to be with us for some time. I don't think COVID will go away. Uh, so therefore, that will require that we transform our lives, we transform the way we do things, uh, and if virtually become uh, digital. So we're going to be engaging. Uh, customers, whether in the branch or online, uh, so that we can, you know, help them uh, achieve what they want to achieve by empowering them in the way we offer products or services.